All right, and welcome back, YouTube. How you doing? We're going to continue on with the next portion of Life is Strange Two Colors. Yeah. We're going to go explore the town and get high while we're at it. I mean, check out the dispensary. <laughs> but yeah, let's do this. Bet Pike's really had his work cut out for him these last few days. Hey, Pike. Hey! Um, how you holding up? Been better. Guess I've been better. Yeah, right. Dumb question. Hey, I want you to know I meant what I said back there. Gabe was something else. He could bring a smile to my face even on the worst days. Yeah. That's what everyone's been saying. And, uh... When you're ready, I still need to get your statement for the investigation. I think I'll be ready soon. Yeah. Yeah. No rush. Poor kid. Came all the way out here for her brother. And now... And now... I've got to figure out the truth. Alright. Withered flowers? Insert epiphany about new beginnings here. <laughs> All right. Um, what is this? Ah, why am I not walking? Move, please. Thank you. Nice to know. Hipsters can survive at this altitude. Wind shot. Where is the dispensary? There it is. Oh, minor. Oh, he's angry. <clears throat> it's bullshit. We have a right to know what's happening to our jobs. You guys don't think anything's really going to change, right? It's hard to say. Yeah, because they won't tell us a damn thing. I just still can't wrap my head around it. Someone died? It's a shit situation, but the least they could do is be upfront with us about our job security. Exactly. I just hope the council passes the vote. So, anyone seen Loudon? Not since his shift that night. Poor son of a bitch. <laughs> we should get him a beer sometime. Oh, I think I might have found an even better way to deal with this for now. You can pause the alert queue. Which means... Because I, I think the visual is going to show up. Because for some reason, even though I turned it off in Streamlabs, it's not. We'll see. L let me know if, uh, you know, if, they, if another bot follows. If the visual shows up. If I'm not paying attention. Because I have the audio off. I think the visual might still show. Actually, no. I'm just going to pause it. Cause then it won't come up at all. Hopefully. We'll see. Hey, one thing about having this happen is I'm learning new things about Streamlabs. <laughs> I keep tight for eight years of my life, and they can't give me back one simple answer about my job. Typhon doesn't give a shit about anyone. Apparently. I don't know why this bot is so like aggressive about following my channel tonight. I really don't I don't get it. But whatever. Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. Nothing says festive like three exclamation points. 
I might be too close to the issue to have an unbiased opinion, but fuck this. Council will be held. This measure proposes selling property no more than 20 acres to time fund mining for use in the open pit mine, both sale profit and blah, 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 more. Okay. I think I read this already. Do you want to do something together next week? Sure. I have a pottery class Wednesday night. Want to join? Uh, class? Uh, maybe? Might be a good time to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. Yeah, I usually Come don't. man. Can't you take a hint? She's not into you. Let it go. That's rough. <laughs> Dude, if I tell him I like him, we'll date, and then we'll break up. And then I'll lose my best friend. Oh. Hmm. Maybe I could help them. Wait, hell no. What am I thinking? This is none of my business. Oh, so she's totally into him, but she's playing it aloof because she wants to make sure Might they stay Might be a friends. good time to check out the dispensary. Guess they didn't feel like painting the mine. Sorry. We met briefly. You're Gabe Chen's sister, right? Alex, yeah. I didn't know him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. I'm so sorry for your loss. Honestly, I like that symbol. <laughs> the dragon with the pot leaves coming out of the head. Yeah. Maybe it could make a good Sorry. hand tattoo. Alex, hey. Jed said you wanted to see me. I just wanted to see how you were doing. I'm okay. Keeping my chin up. Sometimes that's all you can do. How about you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. I hear he's been having a rough time. He practically just lost a father. He's shutting me out. He's never done that before. Not when it mattered. <sighs> Everyone grieves differently. Maybe he just needs some time. We've been through a lot together. With the divorce and moving. He's never shut down like this. I just can't get through to him. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death. Is Gabe. Is Gabe. Yep. What is this? An affidavit from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges in exchange for a payment. A big one. That's shady. That's so shady. Why would they be offering you money if they didn't do anything wrong? 
They say it's an offer of good faith. But you're right. He's dead because of them. And I'd be letting them off. Are you gonna sign it? I don't know. I'm trying to put Ethan first, but... What would you do? Do you think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? Uh... I mean, see, I'm a dad, so like... Get where she's coming from. And the money would be good to take care of your kid. I mean, honestly, I, I can't say I wouldn't take it. I probably would. I mean, I have morals, don't get me wrong. And other people can investigate and figure out what happened to Gabe. And yeah, I'd take the money. You have to put Ethan first. If the money helps, I think you should take it. Thanks, Alex. That means the world. That affidavit feels scummy, but Ethan should come first. Our glass pipes are so cool. They're like works of art that can also get you high. <laughs> I don't have a glass pipe. I have a rubber one, like a high quality rubber one. I like it because glass breaks. Rubber does not. And you would think smoking out of a rubber pipe, it would melt the pipe. Nah, because the the bowl part of it is like a hard plastic that does not melt. Also glass heats up. I've smoked from glass pipes before. And it tends to like burn my fingers, whereas this one does not at all. I'm gonna figure out why Max lying. She said it's not betrayal. Still makes me feel sick. Same. But Gabe would understand. Sweet logo. Bet Charlotte designed it herself. Like seriously. A silver dragon. I actually might get that symbol as a tattoo. <laughs> like, no joke. Probably cost more than my bus ticket. Just small. Somewhere small. We'll see. It all depends on how this game plays out. I'm always here for you if you need anything. Thanks. If I end up loving this game, then maybe. Back at you. Wonder what it's like to have I do my drugs out of a glass sculpture type of money. <laughs> God, put some clothes on. That thing's weird. That's a Zemi. In the Dominican, they're said to house the spirits of gods. Mostly, I just like how it looks. It's really cool. When did you start needing a PhD to smoke pot? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Stairway to Haven? Believe it or not, Gabe named that one. Oh, I believe it. When did you start needing a PhD to smoke pot? Blue Foria, Purple Sublime, Sandman, Etheria, Intergalactic Vibe. Yeah, Stairway it. to Haven? Believe it or not, Gabe named that one. Oh, I believe it. I really love Charlotte's style. Cactus? There's something you don't see in Portland. <laughs> It's a cactus. Charlotte's dedication to her art is so inspiring. 
marijuana tea. There's nothing quite like a cup of weed on a cold day. <laughs> These bougie dispensaries are gonna put all the creepy dudes named Gene out of business. Why Gene? I'm really surprised they didn't say Frank. That would have been more ap you know, applicable because of the previous Life is Strange games. Um, the first one and before the storm, you know, Frank was the fucking pot dealer. Given the circumstances, I could definitely go for a few of these. Man, these things better do the trick. I'm averaging like three hours a night. Pro tip, insomnia doesn't usually come from nowhere and THC is way better at treating it when you're also tackling the underlying cause. Any idea what's keeping you up? Hmm. I hope these helped a little, Gabe. Hmm? Oh, newsletter, I didn't see that. It blows my mind that Charlotte's been running the dispensary this whole time. I couldn't even leave the apartment. Hi everyone, as you may have heard, someone very close to me has recently passed away. The last few days have been very hard on me and Ethan, but we're doing our best. Keep our heads up. So many of you have reached out with kind words and that has meant the world. I cannot thank you enough for your support. I'll try to open the store for a few hours every afternoon, but things will probably be a little sporadic for the next few weeks. Sorry for any inconvenience and thank you in advance for your patience. Your friendly neighborhood bud tender i'd actually like to try my hand at growing um weed but i don't know i don't know if you can buy seeds from the dispensaries and i don't want to go to like you know shady people and he did it all with one rusty saw and a bottle of gin impressive what is this qual feather sanatorium built in 1919 Operated successfully until its closing in 1927 under the guidance of Dr. Martin Kellogg over 500 influenza and ter tuberculosis patients were treated and cured. Tababa tabababa. <laughs> I couldn't fucking talk. These transition things are cool. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Okay. Yeah, a warning would have been nice. It's fine. I love being on hold. I love this song. <laughs> Finally. Ah! Yikes. <laughs> cancel. Cancel. Not transfer. Cancel. I have to imagine Gabe would be amused to know he made it in the newspaper. Representative. <laughs> Representative. That's right. Always remember you must enunciate so the bots can understand Person. what you're saying or just you know pound that zero button mash it mash it hard and hopefully Steph you'll get to a real to person by the record store if i had time hey time for Steph? absolutely Steph asked me to swing by. She's got to be around here somewhere. Gabe was hoping I'd get back into playing. Maybe I will. Helpful. <laughs> be back in five or ten, maybe fifteen. 
Looks like Steph might be working on a new project. Another issue of legendary monster hunter Thanor. It's time to pay a visit to an old friend. Should I say an old enemy? Don't belong here in Monster Slayer. I'm not leaving here until I get answers. Won't be leaving at all. No. Where's the Sky Sword? Fine, I'll tell you. The sword has last seen in the city of Carnier Ca Ca Carnerius. But it's infested with weir spiders. All who quest for that sword lose something dear to them. I'm destined to save the realm with the Sky Sword. Good thing you won't be questing alone. I'll win. Uh, oh, excuse me. Meryl? Cat's name is Valkyrie? That's dope. Val, I just want to be friends. <laughs> Pretty cool name for a cat. Ninth Warden's cool, but not as cool as Thanor. Who's this dude? The breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. How could Chrissy leave me? After everything we've been through together. It's hard to beat breakup music, but maybe I can find something around here to cheer him up. Uh, why? Why do I care about random dude? We all get to see more adventures of Thanor. I can't believe he ordered that record. Fuck. Haven's favorite and only <laughs> choice for modern rock. And I'm only. glad Gabe convinced her to stay. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but... Have you talked to Ethan at all? He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking. What if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like the one you and Gabe were gonna take him to? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. Oh. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. I need your help, though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? So, what do you think? Whoa. Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Or of the underworld. Or of the undead. Stormrider or Kravius? Uh, let's go with the undead one. Stormrider looks like a worthy opponent. He gets my vote. <laughs> All right, then. Oh, I, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. It'd be cool if you could check it out. Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Listeners, that was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. We've got a sweet block of indie rock coming down the pike, but first, a few announcements. The Spring Festival is just around the corner, sponsored by Typhon Mining Company. The mission is free this year, so bring your friends, bring your family. Hell, bring your ex. I'm sure it'll be different this time. <laughs> I like Steph. The breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. All right, comp book. Oh. Looks like Steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions. 
she wants me to play a bard. <laughs> Alex, fill in your character. The bard, name blank, race, half elf, class bard, abilities, distortion field, or healing serenade. How did you meet Thanor? Guess I'm in. Let's start with my name. Oh, I could be Alwyn. Yeah, I remember when I read it. Let's go Alwyn. How about a throwback to Ethan's old buddy? Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. Yeah, let's go healing. Should have been mercy. Should've healing been serenade kind of it is. How did I meet Thanor? Funny story. A wolf and an ogre walk into a bar. Oh, oh God. <laughs> This LARP thing just might work. All right. What's going on here? Cooking up a new adventure for Haven. DM me if you want to get involved. You do. What insanity is coming for us next? DM me. Find out. Whatever it is, I'm in. Oops. I what? That, oh, I didn't realize that was a screenshot button. I just learned something by accident. Woo! I think I have a button for that. Woo! There we go. Got a button for that. All right, off to the flower shop. Bye, Valkyrie. Val, I just want to be friends. Private mining interests will put their bottom lines before your family's health. You don't say. All right, so pray if you pray that I don't overheat tomorrow. I'm going to the forge with my son and my dad Still for the first time. Still need to time. check the flower shop for Mac. So that should be interesting. They guarantee that you will come, you will be done with it and you'll actually make something. I don't know what I'm gonna make. It's probably like a spoon or something. They're definitely not gonna teach us how to make knives because that's like advanced shit. But I'm gonna go pound iron heat it up and yeah it'll be interesting <laughs> and if my son likes it and he's into it then i might continue you know paying for him to do it further because if he gets really good at it people that are really good at forging you can make some serious money off like weaponry and whatnot like serious money if you're good at it I wonder what Steph's working on. It looks cool. I should DM her to find out more and see how I can help. Doesn't happen to have anything to do with your last post, does it? Shoot. If only there was some way to find out. All right, fine. I'll bite. Whatever it is, looks like it's going to be shocking. <laughs> you hush. <laughs> Hey, so what you did with the LARP, thank you so much. Of course, I think Ethan's gonna love it. All right, so flowers. I don't get it. Do people just not want ice cream anymore? I looked over the budget. If we only open three days a week, we'll be able to scrape by. Is that it? Are we always just going to scrape by? Things will get better. Piratey Peaches is making an actual profit, remember? Fine. You were right about Piratey Peaches. Oh, I was right, huh? <laughs> How do those words taste? Not 
Like peaches. <laughs> we should push the rum raisin harder. It's surprisingly addictive. You haven't been putting actual rum in it again, have you? Uh, no. <laughs> anyway, I took out a radio ad too. That'll help. Please, sir. I have to keep up a brave face for Angela. She loves our store so much. He must be exhausted. Sunny, if we're losing our business, but it's like everything's a joke to him. She must feel so alone. Hope they figure it out. This town's gonna make a comeback. Trust me. Nothing says festive like three exclamation points. All right, flower shop we go. Hi ho, hi ho. I forgot her name. What's her name? <laughs> she is not Eleanor? Even... Oh, Eleanor. Oh. <gasps> she was not Sorry. paying attention. <laughs> no need to apologize. How are you, dear? Oh. I'm, um... I'm okay. I'm okay, I guess? Taking it one moment at a time. It's the best way to be. Uh, is Mac here? Oh, he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Can't have gotten too far. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Thanks. Now, what was I? Uh-oh. Hmm. She looks terrified. I can't leave her like this. All right, let's go see what's going on then. Oh God, they're multiplying. Okay, this shirt rules. Is it Riley's? What do you want? You want to make fun of me too, like those other jock assholes? What? No. I, you made a sick killer robot and won a fucking contest. That's. First of all, we got third place. And anyway, it's not a robot. Technically, he's. Ugh. God, way to take the bait, right? Hmm. You know what? Fuck those pricks. You rule. And I would really like to see your robot. If you want to show me. That's an innuendo right there, if I ever heard one. Oh, just saying. Innuendo! It's the cool gnome. That guy is still bad to the gnome. <laughs> What's that? Oh, nothing. Just something funny Gabe said. That boy and his jokes. <laughs> I should get an emotional support dog. But like, for other people. Hello? Why don't I have the A button option? Maybe I don't need to do that. There we go. Okay. Time to figure out why she's afraid. 
how does she hide all of this? All my memories are fading. I feel broken. Again, dementia. Doctor said I had more time, but everything is becoming so out of order. Yep. Riley, Riley finds, finds out. out. She can't, she can't find, find out. out. How does she hide all of this? Okay, not yet. There's more I gotta find. The doctor says I had more time. What am I missing? Ah. If they know if they about my condition, my condition, they'll make me close, this, me place. close this place. Holy shit. just that she forgot what she was doing she's afraid she's forgetting everything but how can I help her I don't know forget what you were working on <sighs> you could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment <laughs> well maybe I can help Ask Riley, think hard, or focus on... Retrace your steps. Ask Riley. Um... Seems like you have a lot going on today. I could help you retrace your steps. Oh, I don't want to keep you. Not the hey. right choice. I... I want to help. <laughs> okay. What would Eleanor have done first? I don't fucking know. 
first. Oh, the sign. Yeah, absolutely a sign. You must have flipped the sign to open. I always flip it first thing when I come in. And then I open my mail. Something must have distracted me. Better. We can do this. Alright, so you open your mail, right? Something must have distracted you. Did you trim these flowers today? I don't remember. Okay, maybe not that then. You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. You don't have to do this. I'll be all right on my own. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. What would have distracted her? Hmm. I don't know. I'm not getting any other prompts, so... What's in here? Oh, the phone. That makes sense. Could a phone call have distracted you? Yes. I got a call first thing in the morning. But I can't think who it was. Maybe we can find something to remind you. I wonder who called. Could it have been Riley who called? I think that's right. She called to tell me about a new order. Oh, goodness. What was the order for? Four. This. Rush order. This must be what Riley came in for. I think that order might have been for these lilies. Of course. Riley helped me pick them out before she left. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. Should. Mr. Jedediah Lucan, huh. Looks like the lilies are for Jed. That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. Got it. I knew you'd figure it out. I couldn't have done it without you. Seriously, Alex, you're a godsend. <clears throat> Jed must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. Oh, man. God. She doesn't remember. I got 
gotta tell her. <coughs> they were... They were for Gabe's wake. Gabe's wake? Gabe's wake? I... missed it. Sorry. Hey, it's um... Excuse me. <laughs> we need to tell Riley about her mom. She needs help. Okay. That sucked. But at least I told her the truth. Okay. Riley is officially a badass. That poor young man. How did I forget? I'm so sorry, Eleanor. She's really hurting, but I didn't want to lie to her. I've definitely lived in uglier places. <laughs> Search for Mac near the flower shop. Okay. Save. Nice. Eleanor said Mac is nearby. I don't see him here. Maybe at the bridge? Anyone have any good advice for taming stray cats? Found this cutie in my trash cans, but he's a crazy pants. It takes time. That much is true. We have a cat that's been living outdoors in our neighborhood pretty much his whole life, as far as we know. And we have slowly over months been befriending him. And it's been working to get him to the point where we can get him to the vet and get him checked out and all that kind of stuff. Mostly my dad has been doing the work, but yeah, it takes a lot of time. So that's a big cat. He's a chonker. Jasmine, that's not a stray. That's a mountain lion cub. Be very careful. They can be very aggressive when threatened. Try leaving a door open. It may leave on its own. And if he's under my bed, broom? I'm calling animal control. <laughs> That's a mountain lion cub. I was going to say, it doesn't look quite like a cat. Looks a bit more aggressive. Couldn't be more excited to announce that a new face will be joining the community soon. Everyone, welcome Jack Stevens, who will be taking over the restaurant next to the park. Hey, everyone. Excited to serve you all soon. From the Haven, happy to have you swing over anytime. If you need anything, it's a trap. <laughs> it's a trap. All right. Well, that's going to do it for my stream tonight and for this video on YouTube. So have a good night. I want to do a little bit of something, something on my own before I have to pass out in like 40 minutes because I have to get up super early tomorrow to go forging with my son and my dad. So that'll be fun. No, I really hope it's going to be fun. I, I really am looking forward to it. So I'll see y'all. I'll be back tomorrow. I will. Because we'll get back in time for me to stream tomorrow. So have a good night. Thanks for coming by. Have a good whatever you're having, YouTube. And I'll see you next time. Bye.